right question number 1 says in what ways do human beings make use of this special sense of smell of dogs so the answer is this special sense of smell of dogs is used by humans in many ways some examples are for catching criminals for detecting stolen goods for detecting bombs further question number 2 says when do you find your sense of smell helpful to you list some examples like to know by its smell that food has gone bad or that something is burning so the answer is apart from smelling bad food or a burning object we can also recognize the smell of following that is tasty food perfume incense sticks flowers sweaty clothes gas leak in the kitchen etc now name the animals that you would be able to recognize only by the smell without seeing them so the answer is we can recognize following animals by their smell that is dog cats buffalo cow fish etc now question number 3 says write the names of the five things whose smell you like and five things whose smell you do not like so the answer is i like the smell of food perfume flowers instant stick fresh air and the smell i do not like are garbage dead fish cow dung smell from urinal stale air now question number 4 says do you and your friend have similar answers so the answer is yes our answers are similar now turn to page number 5 think and discuss here question number 1 says sushila so covered her nose when she cleaned deepak's nappy but not when she cleaned her daughter why do you think she did this so the answer is when we feel something is dirty we find it smell bad in case of sushila she thought deepak's nappy to be dirty so she had to cover her nose when she was cleaning her daughter's nappy she did not think of it being dirty now question number 2 says How do you feel when you walk near a heap of garbage? Think of the children who spend the whole day picking things from such garbage. So the answer is I feel bad when I walk near a heap of garbage. Children who spend the whole day picking things from such garbage become used to the smell. Their minds do not get offended by the smell. Further, question number 3 says is the smell good or bad? for everyone in the same way or does it depend on how each one feels about it so the answer is it depends on how the person thinks about a particular smell but some smells can always be bad for most of the people now turn to page number 6 let's see here question number 1 says write the name of a bird which has eyes in front of its head so the answer is owl second Write the names of the some birds which have eyes on either side of the head. What is the size of their eyes as compared to the size of their head? So the answer is pigeon, crows, sparrows, eagles, etc. Their eyes are very small as compared to the size of their head. Now turn to page number 8. Right. Here question number 1 says the names of 10 animals whose ears can be seen. So the answer is dog, cow, cat, buffalo, rabbit, elephant, lion, zebra, giraffe and mouse. Further, question number 2 says the names of the some animals whose ears are bigger than our ears. So the answer is elephants, rabbits, cows, buffaloes, dogs etc have ears bigger than our ear. Now think Question number 1 says is there some link between the size of animals ear and their hearing so the answer is there is possibly a link between the size of animals ears and its earrings animals with bigger ears have better hearing than animals with a small ear further moving to our next part that is right question number 1 says can you understand the sounds of some animals and which animals are they So the answer is yes I can understand the sound of some animals I can easily tell the sound of dog cat 
cow, horse, etc. Further question number 2 says, Do some animals understand your language? And which one? So the answer is, yes. Some pet animals like dogs, cows, ox, parrot and so on understand our language. Now turn to page number 13. Here find out. Here question number 1 says, Where are other such national parks in India? So guys you can do it yourself. I can give you some examples like Gil National Park in Gujarat, Kaziranga National Park in Assam, Kana National Park in Madhya Pradesh and rest you can do it yourself. Now question number 2 says, Collect information on these and write a report. So the answer is, National parks have been made to protect animals and plants. Protecting animals and plants is necessary to protect our environment. Some animals get special status in these parks. For example, Kaziranga National Parks gives special protection to rhines, which are very rare species in the world. Similarly, Gil National Park gives special protection to lions. So now, what we have learned? Here question number 1 says, Have you noticed that sometimes singers put their hands on the ear when they sing? Why do you think they may be doing this? So the answer is, yes, I have noticed singers putting their hands on the ear while singing. They do this to minimize noise. They also do this to hear their own voice more clearly. Now question number 2 says, Give examples of animals that may have a very strong smell of sign, hearing and smell. So answer is, a police dog can smell explosives which cannot be detected by human beings. Second, an eagle can see its small prey from high in the sky. Third, a dog can hear the finest sound of someone's footstep. Fourth, a mosquito can find a human being by smelling his body odor. Fifth, some animals behave in strange manner in case of natural calamities which is about to happen. So guys, I have covered all the questions of this chapter 